what up guys this is Pastor Canavi again we're coming up with another tutorial in Python uh, tonight we're going to be we're going to be talking about uh, classes right uh, what is a class so a class before we start please uh, like the video this video help you a lot and then um, yeah subscribe to the channel so we can keep on growing little by little but short surely okay what is a class um, a class is a piece of code from which you can generate a unique object right for example let's talk about this for a little bit so let's pretend like you have a car right there is like a bunch of different models of cars there is like you know there is a Ferrari there is a Lamborghini there is a Ford all of the different cars so we're going to create a class right just to talk about this as a class example so a car has a attribute so which is going to be like the year the mo the model model does it say model the year the model the color um, the doors etc right and what what would be the method the method would be what what can a car do a car can go that could be a method also the car is stopped that can be a method a car turns also can be a method and a car can park could be a method right so now another example like you know let's pretend that you're in a in a gym and, and it's your business and you want to keep track of every single member you know how do you do that so you you create a class member where you're going to have as an attribute you're going to have like the username you're going to have the full name etc right and then as a method you can just have you know like the archive you can have uh, uh, restore the account you know and etc so one more example is a dog a dog class dog um, the attributes for a dog would be the name the breed the color the height and the weight and what will be the methods? It would be the what did, what can dogs do? They can eat, sleep, bark, fetch, and whatever else they can do. So let's just start with our class. We talk enough already. So let's start. Let's put a class. We're going to start with the class. You can give it to the class like anything as a class name. You know, as long as it starts with a capital letter, because it will that way it will be different from your regular variable so let's put member right and always remember you gotta finish your class with column and now you gotta um, uh, do a function or a method you know we we'll have def which is short for definition um, and we are going to use the init method for this okay which are going to be uh, which what is the init init is just it is it is a name of the building python method so we're going to it's right there it's already there so init it has with the variable name which is going to be self um, right so and and self is part of the variable name is used to refer to the object being created okay okay let's give it a name we're going to put right here comma username username oh man username comma and we're going to put full name Okay. Now, right here, we want to start with the word uh, self. Self that uh, username equals username. There is no semicolon right here. You know, getting confused sometimes with uh, C sharp. Uh, you, do, you do equal to self and now you do the next variable which is going to be a full name 
equals full name. Okay. So now, since you have followed this, uh, now we gotta give him. Um, we're going to create an instance of the member. So, which means we're going to create a variable name right here. Um, since we have a new member, right? We want to know like the username. We want to know the full name. So, we're going to put right here a new person. Equals to member. And right here, we are going to pass the names. So let's put Jonathan. Uh, a username. Hmm. It's username. Let's put Jung. Uh, yeah, let's put Loreto like a username. Start name of my city in Peru. And you do comma. And then you're going to have like the full name. Let's just put Jonathan. Jonathan uh, Smith or something like that. Okay. Um, okay. Now we are going to uh, print this information in the console. So we're going to call the new person, which is right there. And we are going to put that and username. That should be the first one. Let's copy this and paste in the next line. And uh, we're going to change that to full name. Full name. Okay, so let's print this and see what result is going to give us. Let's print that on the console. Nice. So it gave me the name, the username, which is Loreto, which we have it right here. And then I give me the full name, Jonathan Smith, which is cool. And also, what you can do, you can change. Um, like the, the username too. You know, you can just put it like a different name. Um, and that, you can do that with no issues at all. So, we can try the following. So, we're going to do new guy in a different line right here. I mean, new person. And we can change a new person that username equals to uh, what should we put it right here? Let's put PC or oh, let's PC Juan Echo or something. I'm just coming with random names right here right so and then we can just do um, copy this part right here and let's uh, run the program so right here right at the beginning we have Loretto's so username and then we have Jonathan Smith and then and also we have PC Juan Echo and Jonathan Smith. Right? Yeah, you can change all of this. Yeah, we can also like change new person that full name. We can put right here will be the full name let's put um, let's put my name pastor canaya 
Let's run it. Yep, we got Loreto as a username. We got Jonathan Smith. We got PC Juaneco, and then we got Pastor Canayo, right? This is how helpful it is doing a class. So you can just keep track of every single member. And, you know, as long as you just kind of um, do it right, it will work for you. But anyway, so that was just a little example uh, of the class. So hopefully um, you guys like this. And, yeah, like the video, subscribe to the channel. We'll just keep building more, more uh, increasing. It is, oh man, I can't even talk anymore. If this video help you in your journey to becoming a web dev, you know, in Python, great. I'm more than welcome and I'm happy for that, you know. Just uh, subscribe to the channel and share the, the video. Okay, thanks. Have a good night. Okay, bye-bye.